Guys, we are back, and we were discussing uh, the penicillin and its relative. So now the time for the other beta lactam, which are estriolin, and of course, which is a monobactam. and uh, there is a carba penem we know that carba penem has four drug one is imipenem meropenem erdapenem and the last dori penem so now come to the estronium I call estrogenum is a blessing drug because it has many many good things. First of all, we start with the mechanism of action, and thanks to penicillin that we don't have to memorize because it is similar mechanism of action like we did in the penicillin. Means it inhibit the cell wall synthesis by inhibiting the cross linking. of what peptide like in by binding to the penicillin yes binding protein okay now comes about the good thing it is beta lactamase resistant why because it lacks thiazolidin ring what is thiazolidin ring we all know that we have watched the superman and in the superman there is a mark which is like this and i draw s over here for the superman now in this ring it is sulfur and n over here so it becomes ring of thiazolidin and it is lacking in the estrionem so that's why it is resistant to the penicillin what else we have good thing about the estrionem we know that it is synergistic with the amino glycoside it can be used in the renal insufficiency it can also be used if the patient is allergic to penicillin and the cephalosporin so we can use this estrionem and these days we are using estrionem and imipenem a lot one more thing that its clinical uses we can use this drug in the gram negative rod now the question can we use this drug against the gram positive rod or the an anaerobes no we can't use in the gram positive rod or the anaerobes so we can't use this drug against this organism so basically if we talk about specifically what type of organism so it is gram negative and the list are e coli pseudomonas here is a little bit cramming klebsiella hemophilus influenzae and enterobacter Citrobacter and last but not the least, it is used against the many gram negative, which is etc. So here we are done with the estrogen.